any old chum. Usual potato mochi, please. And make it for, th make it for three today as well. I'm still waiting for my apology mochi. Have you all heard the grave news? That friends eat Weaver from the rumors. It ended up mauling some of our galaxy folks who went out to investigate this one. Medical Corps has been has had a hard time getting all the injuries back in the field. Ah, this is the fever that was reportedly struck by powerful lightning, yes. Here he's been behaving most erratically since then. Still, if, if further investigation is in the Survey Corps will, of course, step up to the task. A certain amount of danger is inevitable in researching unfamiliar Pokemon. But I'm sure Grub here can handle things just fine. Are you certain? I've heard Cleaver so mighty, even Alpha Pokemon don't compare to him. Now, now, you forget that the strengths of Pokemon are key items of information that we of the for are duty bound to research. And since this perilous work of ours calls for a clear head and fighting pit physique, I do believe a good night's sleep is in order after this fine meal. Good morning! You should hurry to the commander's office before he decides to use you for sumo practice. I think he already did that once. So, uh, yeah, we're not gonna... Probably shouldn't leave commander waiting. There you are. Let's hurry to headquarters. Look who's being punctual. Finally realized you're wasting almighty Sinnoh's precious time by blowing, by bowing to a sham. There you go again, insisting on your false image of almighty Sinnoh as a ruler of time. My people follow the true almighty Sinnoh, the font of all creation and ruler of space. Let's just deal in Palkia, not Arceus. Now I'm even more confused. Huh. You could have all the space there is and still not and still not know what to do with it. Excuse me, are you really suggesting that you make better use of your time? Then we make a vast Hisui space? Better than some. It's a miracle you showed up on time. Oh, mighty leader of the Pearl Clan. Okay, now it makes more sense about it. Oh. I, I, I know where this is going. Diamond Clan. Dialga. Clan, Palkia, but they both think it's the same entity known as Sinnoh when the superior being is Arceus, who created the Sinnoh. I, yeah, I, can see this one. I worried you'd get lost in the pointlessly vast space you're so fond of and never show up. Me, get lost, and all my Sinnoh's great gift to the Pro Clan and our world's very basis? You wish. I wish that I hadn't let myself get dragged into arguing with you. Almighty Sinnoh, forgive me. What a waste of time. I'm off to Commander Otto's office. I believe it was you who started this. You can feel the tension when those two show up. You haven't met them, have you? The woman with the reverence for space is Rita, leader of the Pearl Clan. The man who's going on and on about time, Adaman, leads the Diamond Clan. Yeah, this Dialga for Diamond, 
I'll go Zoom Master one more time. Pearl Clan. Pearl has Palkia. There's a leader of space. The Diamond Clan and Pearl Clan grudgingly coexist at the moment. Apparently things used to be less peaceful. But the boss, I mean the commander, is waiting. Excuse me? The boss? We should save this conversation for after you report to him. Tend to do about that cleaver, Commander Kamado. He may be descended from a warrior of Almighty Sinnoh, but look at the mess he's causing. He can't sit back and let him rage on. You do get right to the point. Time wasted is lost. Well, tell me, what would you have us do? Cleaver is a precious lord of the Pearl Clan, is it not? Point. My clan can't di intervene directly where a lord of Pearl Clan's concerned. My people would to do something, our two clans might end up back at each other's throats, just like we used to be. But even folk on the Galaxy team have been wounded, haven't they? I think someone's got to do something here. Who then? Would the Diamond Clan have the Pearl Clan bring down one of its own honored nobles? I don't believe I said that. Thought it, maybe. <laughs> you might as well have said it, you fool. Look, we don't even know what drove Lord Cleaver into such a violent frenzy. I'd like to know that myself. This is a first as far as my clan knows, too. Hmm. I see you've arrived. This is Rook, the newest member of our Serpent Corps. Aha, I hear from May, you earned Wide Ear's favor. Good to finally meet you, stranger from the Rift. I'm Adaman, leader of the Diamond Clan, if you want to be formal. But that's just a mouthful. Just call me Adaman. If you came from beyond the space time rift, could you from the space where Almighty Sinnoh is said to reside? I'm Irida, leader of the Pearl Clan. Caution and foresight are my watchwords, which is why I have trouble believing such a tale. Could you really have passed through that rift? I have a proposition. Why not send this one to study Cleaver before deciding what must be done? You'd send this stranger, who supposedly fell from the rift, to study Cleaver? This newcomer with no experience? Says the leader with almost no experience. Being a good leader isn't a matter of time. It's a matter of embracing Hisui's vastness without fear. Well, then, there you have it. If how new you are doesn't matter, then let's give Kid his chance. I'm sold, Commander. Let's try this your way. This should be fun. I'll get to see how good you galaxy folk really are, with all your weird ways. Putting Pokemon in those strange balls and what have you. That whole practice bothers me. Almighty Sinnoh made Hisui vast so Pokemon could live freely throughout. We're meant to stand alongside Pokemon, not count ourselves above them. We do not use Pokeballs from a desire to control our Pokemon so that we can live together. Well, I'll also show you what we can do. This is your mission now, Rob. I order you to study Cleaver and help us find the truth of this situation. I accept. 
Last time I said, uh, I got thrown. Remember that you are a stranger who appeared one day out of the very sky above us. People are naturally suspicious, suspicious of your presence. If you wish to be fully accepted and trusted, you must work hard. Work yourself to the very bone. Mission. The Frenzy Lord of the Woods. Well, that's settled. And there's no time like the present. The Lord of the Woods, Cleaver, is descended from a Pokemon that was blessed with Almighty Sinnoh's own power so much. No other Pokemon you get encountered can compare to his strength. Be warned. Listen to me. The Galaxy Expedition team has come to the Hisui region as a group of outsiders. Some might even call us interlopers. We mustn't do anything to threaten our relations with the Diamond Pro clans. Understood? Join me downstairs, bro. We'll cover the details of this new mission. What Pokemon? I mean, the Pseudo Ludo. Pseudo Ludo wasn't Gen 4. I think the Gen 4 Pokemon. Turtle, Rova, not the one. One of the tri uh, I think it would be. What's the third one? Torterra. Maybe. Ah, good. You're already here. Professor Leventon, briefing, if you please. Yes, let's get straight to it. So, bro, I understand you've been requested to find out the cause of Cleaver's frenzied state. But as you are aware by now, Cleaver is a mighty thing. Not invincible, even. The security Corps tried throwing Pokeballs at Cleaver when they were attacked, but I'm afraid they didn't even come close to catching him. It seems he's a far trickier opponent than even the most aggressive species of Pokemon that cannot be caught outside of the battle once they're riled. I'd like to be perfectly clear on this point. This mission will put you in extreme danger. Do you believe you can handle it? Of course. Very well. Let's go over the particulars. The Diamond and Pearl clans revere their nobles because they believe these Pokemon serve their all in They leave offerings to express their gratitude of, to these Pokemon in locations they call the Nobles' Seats. So perhaps a good starting point for our research could be to find out what sorts of offerings they normally leave for this group. Grub, we need to speak with you. Listen, that ripped in space-time seems like it connects this world to a whole other world. That world might be where Almighty Sinnoh itself resides. True Almighty Sinnoh, that is. One that rules over time. So if you fell through the space time rift, that might mean you traveled through time by Almighty Snow's own power. That would make sense, but it wasn't Dialga. Think of it. You must have been just swimming in its divine might. It was something like that. Well, I've got a favor to ask of you. Oh, amazing time traveler. Don't just study Cleaver. Well, his frenzy. Well, you certainly caught us at a good time, young Adaman. We were just discussing our next, next steps with regard to this whole Cleaver situation. Oh, you must be that Galaxy Team scholar I've heard about. Good to meet you, Mr. Professor. Mr. Professor? That's a new one. Share some of that knowledge with me sometime. Now, let me elaborate a little. Those Pearl Clan types have a lot of respect for Cleaver. You heard his title. 
the Lord of the Woods. I'm sure they'd rather get this under control too. But it's hard for them to come right out and ask those of the Galaxy team of all people for help. And the truth is, we in the Diamond Clan have a similar problem on our hands. Pokemon dear to us off of the mountains and is fun in the same type of frenzy as Cleveland. Now, there's certainly bad blood between us and the Pearl Clan, but still, we've all got to share Hisui, and that means we ought to tackle our problems together. But there aren't many capable of standing up to such a powerful Pokemon. You're the best hope we've got. I'm playing Beaver at Grant Tree Arena. That's in the very heart of the heart. His ward is a boy named Ian. Ian is a brilliant child, but also a bit... Well, sometimes brilliance can be blind, you know. He'll tell you all about his beloved cleaver, whether you wish him to or not. Anyway, I'm sure you're up to the challenge. So we'll be counting on you. See you later. Why do I feel like that's going to cost me? He certainly left quickly once he finished talking. I suppose he really values his time. Adam and I weren't wrong, you know. If you're to study and perhaps even well, Cleaver, you best start by visiting his abode. Our new Heights Camp would be a handy place for setting out towards Grand Tree Arena. And you should stop by the pastures too. You'll want to choose the best Pokemon to bring. So, let's get a move on. Finding yourself unable to pick up the materials you come across? Satchel always seeming full? That sounds like you. It'd be wise to lend me your ear a moment and hear what I have to say. can carry even more in that satchel of yours if you learn the trick of packing things in. I can teach you if you'd like. What do you say? Sure. I'd like I like your initiative. My teaching fee is a neat 100 Poké Dollars. I think those Poké Dollars? I don't know. I mean, I believe that's the symbol, but... Alright. Sure. Perfect. Then let me your ear for a moment. You've made space to keep one more kind of item in your satchel. And that's all there is to it. You see how much more you can fit in by packing things rightly? If you want to be able to carry even more things, there's more I can teach you. What do you say? Here, two on. Perfect. I'm here for a moment. Uh, maybe later. Now we heal it. Okay. So, now. First thing I want to do is I want to get a ride in the That is for sure. Huh. 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 Let's, uh. Well, first off. Yeah. And then we could use a we could use a hmm. Yeah. I mean the booze will have to be trained because it's only level three compared to the rest of the team. But It knows absorb. So that's actually we actually have a decently well-rounded team. Uh, I'm gonna save real quick though. Also, up, up level twenty and below. What are my Pokemon? Level twelve. Hmm. So I think. First thing we should probably do. Oh, hang on. Power things, my good friend. 
I certainly hope you're putting that secret backstrike technique I taught you to good use. Huh? Either way, I have some super potions here, just for you. Oh, think nothing of it. Having the Survey Corps out and about studying Pokemon is great for business, you know. Supporting you now is actually an investment in my own fortunes. You obtained three super potions. 100 HP. Nice. And now I must depart. There are ruins that are just calling to me. Ruins? Well, I guess we did get a chance to see. Yeah. Richie's Lost Satchel. Yeah, because that's past that. Okay. We gotta go all. We gotta go all the way over there. Okay, so this isn't just as much as I want to keep going. We're gonna need to. We gotta go through. Oh wow. I wonder. Hmm. That's the case. Huh. There's lots of things. Let, let's. Oh, so you gotta... 